Good morning, everyone. Sitting here waiting for my teenage son. Oh my goodness, look at my hair. Crazy, crazy. Okay, so I'm trying this view instead. I didn't know I was leaving all of that stuff. Thank goodness to Jess with Jay Wackers for letting me know that I was doing that. Zeus is in the back. We're just waiting for Peyton. We're going to be taking him to work today. Then we're going to be doing some house cleaning and stuff like that. I've decided to leave my Christmas decorations up for quite some time. Not like into June or anything, but we'll see how I feel. It does take me a long time to get them all down, so it might take me a bit. But I just wanted to say good morning to everyone. I wanted to let everybody know that I was watching my videos on my phone. So they looked like they were filling up the screen. I'm sorry for those of you guys that watch them on your computer or on the TV. So please forgive me and I will try to film like this as much as I can. All right, guys, I will talk to you soon. Oh, you get to see the peacock tree up close today. All right, bye guys. So just got back from taking Peyton to work and I'm getting ready to take the garbage out. And this is in the middle of our driveway. We got a little light dusting of snow. So I just had to show you guys what type of prints we're getting instead of just footprints. Anybody know what they are? Okay, everyone, here's the peacock tree. And this topper, this is just a Walmart topper that I got a couple years ago. I want to build one, I just haven't had, a had the time. I actually had peacock feathers in my Amazon cart this year, but they didn't fit within my budget, so I just carried on without. You're gonna see a lot of different ornaments on here that I have collected for the peacock tree. And just so you know, these little actual little peacocks, they're just little clips. Let me get to the front of his face here. Oh, there's his face right there. They're really cute. Um, I did get these from Walmart as well. And I would have to say these are my favorite ones right here. Absolutely love those. I added some picks because you guys know I love the picks. And we've got some different type of curly ribbons and we've got some berries, different things like that. A lot of these I got online. And so we've got a lot of purples. Um, we've got some glass ornaments. We've got some plastic ornaments. We've got some flashy ornaments. We've got these here. Um, I also have these, which go great in the tree, but guess what? They jingle and they're feathers. Ugh, not a good idea for cats, but I'm dealing with it. And I peeled off the fingernail polish off of my pointing finger today, so I apologize for that, but keeping it real, right? Then we've got, oh, this one's crooked. My girl cat is climbing in this tree, just so you guys know. All right, so you can go down through here, another one of the peacocks. And then I do have a few peacock feathers in here. And these are ones that my mother gave me. So very sentimental. Again, I'm sure you guys can tell that this year has been kind of a tough one for me. But I am trying to stay on the positive. And that's why it was so important for me to share this Christmas tree and all of my decor with you. So this shows you a little bit better up close with some actual light. What the tree looks like. And then here are the peacocks that I was telling you guys about. So there's one right there. There is a purple bulb right behind his head. So let me, let me move him out a little bit so you guys can see him a little bit better. So my mother-in-law gave me these. They are so pretty. They are metal. They've got awesome tails there. I can tell you guys this. I love this tree skirt that I have under here. But under a flock tree... It's always a mess and I'm always cleaning it and trying to clean it. And I've kind of given up now, just so you guys know. But um, I've got some layering in here. You can see one of the secrets of my trees that I do is I put bulbs way back into the tree so it gives, gives it depth. If you look far enough back in right here, I'm going to put my finger in here so you guys can maybe see right here. That is a big bulb all the way back inside of there. So absolutely beautiful. And here is my other peacock that stands next to my tree. So I've got both of the mothers in my life represented in this tree because I've got my, my own mother's peacock feathers. And then I've got my husband's mom, AKA my mom. I've got um, the awesome peacocks that she got for me to put near the tree. So I'm just gonna go around the tree and play some music so that you guys can see everything that's on it.
here we are. The baby puppies are just getting moved out of their bed and getting put in their hallway bed where they don't sleep all night. So they're all awake and moving. And we've got, let's see if we've got the little boy's eyes, his eyes opening. Yes, yes, yes. He's finding a spot though. Look at those little eyeballs open. They're so cute. They're snuggling up together, going back to sleep. Oh, these baby puppies have been such a blessing this Christmas season. Thank you guys all for joining us. I just want to leave you with all of these cute pictures and videos of the baby Yorkies. Thank you for staying around till the end of this video. If you aren't already subscribed, please consider subscribing. And thank you to those who have journeyed along with us so far. Oh, here is our baby, and we decided to name him Loki, and we will be keeping him. So I hope you guys have an amazing day, and I look forward to seeing you guys tomorrow. Bye for now.